The Soybean School on realagriculture.com is brought to you by Pride Seeds, Nodulator Pro, and Cruiser Max Vibrance Beans. Yeah, well, over here, hey, listen, I know I'm short and I have a green shirt, but certainly you can see me from here. This is a pretty neat thing to look at. If you look over to my right, you'll notice uh, a soybean field where we sprayed glyphosate once, kept weeds clean up into the third trifoliate stage, but we had some late emerging weeds. You notice a few scapes there. Let's compare that to my left, where we not only did that first pass to control the early weeds, but then we followed up with an application just at early flowering to deal with those late emerging weeds. And the difference in control now in August is pretty significant. So what's the difference? Well, when it comes to yield, they're probably both gonna yield the same because weeds were kept controlled up into the third trifoliate stage in both situations. But the main difference between going in twice and controlling weeds that one last time at the flowering stage is I minimize the amount of weed seed that's returned to the soil that will be there next year, the year after, future years down the road. So I've always liked the idea of going in one last time to clean up any last weed escapes as a tool to minimize weed seed return and to improve weed control down the road. So that's the main difference between going in twice or just going in once.